I've been freelancing for the past four years, making my own work. I often say that I don't want to have a choreographic signature. Every time I work, I would like to make something different. Although I am aware, as I grow up as an artist, my personal style is gradually emerging. I like to make dance that is thought-provoking as well as visually compelling. I believe that movement carries meaning and therefore is a very powerful medium of communication. I use strong autobiographical suggestions and aim to make work that becomes universal to reach, touch and move people. I believe that what makes a strong work of art is authenticity and a defined sense of identity that makes it unique and original. A strong work is open and able to stimulate people in many levels, emotional, intellectual or conceptual. I like to consider choreography as a visual art. I understand choreography as the product of a chain of images, each of which has full significance, as it happens in the arts of sculpture and cinema. Sculpture inspires me in movement making, while storyboarding helps me in structuring the work. I love Baroque sculptures, while Alfred Hitchcock, Stanley Kubrick and Lars von Trier are directors that I find very inspiring for their elegance and use of tension. I like to use cinematic atmospheres on stage. In my latest work, I have also explored the relationship between choreography and music for the first time. My colleague Runa Kaiser and I have founded a band and created a performance merging live rock music and contemporary dance, featuring seven original songs about dead pets and lost loves. In the past weeks I have been involved in Arts Cross, an international research project including choreographers and dancers from the UK, Taiwan and China. As a response to its theme, leaving home, being elsewhere, I worked on images of being lost at sea and carried by the waves, inspired by Homer's Odyssey and the movie Jason and the Argonauts. This is a small excerpt featuring the five male dancers I worked with, warming up and rehearsing a movement sequence inspired by Grecian friezes. I would love to develop this idea into my first full-length show as a choreographer. <laughs> 